This is our Breakfast Connect dashboard. You can see there are a number of widgets that can give various bits of information about locker usage, manage one to many lockers, whether you're at a single school campus or at the district level where you're managing multiple lockers at multiple sites. That's the power of our cloud platform. We have multiple elements we can manage and give attributes to, the locker being one, also users and assets. Users in this case are the students, and from the locker users tab, you would create and give attributes to define who they are and how they would authenticate with our locker to gain access, whether that's through a NARF ID card or a PIN code. Creating users can be done in a variety of ways. You can do it one by one within Connect, you can download a template file and do a bulk import upload, or the third way is you can build custom connectors to a user database through our developer APIs to automate that process. We've created a user already in this test case. I named her Susie Jones and gave her a, a six digit pin code. Susie opens a trouble ticket and IT approves a swap. IT then would assign Susie a bay where a device is being held as such. They then provide directions to Susie on where to pick up the device using her student ID number and instructs her to leave the broken device in the bay in order to be repaired. Susie goes to the locker she was assigned. She enters her student ID number, grabs the brand new device, and leaves the old one in there for IT to pick up. I can see through our logs when that bay was accessed instantaneously and via which authentication. I see Susie access the bay using her authorized PIN so I know she completed her action. As an extra step as an administrator, I can now lock that bay down temporarily so that Susie or anyone that knows her PIN code cannot go back to that bay and regain access to that locker. Perhaps IT wants to isolate that device in quarantine for 48 hours for safety reasons before picking up the device and reassigning that bay to another user. I hope you found this useful and were able to gain a better glimpse into how Bradford TechArt Connect lockers can help facilitate a no-contact device swap.